Hello, hello? Hello? Happy Wednesday, everybody! How are you today? Let me just double check the last things are opened and then we will begin. Put that there. There we go. All right. I think. Wait. Wait. Yeah, I think we're we're pretty good. I think we're pretty good to go. So we'll begin. But hello, everybody. Welcome in. How are you doing? How is your Wednesday going so far? Uh, I hope you're having a good day. My day uh, started off pretty okay. I, I will say I was not able to sleep very well last night. Um, so I'm a little tired. Couldn't, couldn't, really, couldn't really fall asleep. Like I was about to. Like I was almost falling asleep at my desk. And so then I went to bed. And then could not fall asleep. And so then I was just up <laughs> for a very long time. And I was like, why was I like about to fall asleep over here? Like uh, nodding off. And then now sleep has just completely surpassed my grasp. And I, I just don't understand how that works. But uh, the rest of the day uh, started off all right. Went to the grocery store. Picked up just a couple of things, uh, came back, uh, ate some lunch. So I've eaten food, which is kind of a rare occurrence before stream. But I've eaten some food, uh, and then uh, I, like I said in my Discord, I went to go make some coffee and then start stream. However, I do not have coffee. Um, so I have a little, You get, some of you guys know, I have a little like espresso machine. It's like a cheap one off of Amazon, I think. it's It probably doesn't make coffee at its best, um, but it works and it has, a, it steams milk and it's hot and it's great. However, um, so I had to clean it the other day. And the way you clean it is with using citric acid. And so you put a bunch of citric acid in, like uh, you mix it in with water and you just run it through the system a few times and then you uh when you're done uh it like it basically just cleans out all of the gunk i guess on the inside and then uh like it breaks it all down uh then you just run it a couple of times um with just water and then that like cleans it all out it also flushes out all of the sour stuff i guess i did not flush it out en enough uh, because I made my coffee, and uh, the first taste of it was uh, it was not good. <laughs> it it wasn't like drinking soured milk. That it wasn't like that bad. But it was like drinking candy. If if someone put a bunch of flavorless sour patch kids into milk and coffee <laughs> and then served it to you uh which is not good yeah so i actually ended up wasting a bunch of coffee and milk today <laughs> and that is sad for me um because <laughs> i part of the reason why i haven't had coffee in the past like uh two weeks is because I'm trying to, like, be a little bit more frugal. Trying to be a little bit more uh, careful with my monies. And, uh... Uh... I was like, it's okay, it's fine. We... <laughs> we can... We will buy some milk today. We'll make some coffee. It'll be great. I need it because I didn't get a good amount of sleep last night. And now... Ugh, it was so bad. So now I just have... I had a little bit leftover of steamed milk uh and so i'm just having basically what's that called is that called a steamer i forget what that's called that's a name when you just get like steamed milk with a little bit of flavoring so i'm i'm basically just drinking steamed almond milk uh <laughs> right now mm, 
Num 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 num. Um, I made coffee the other day without realizing our milk had gone bad. Oof, that was no bueno. Yeah, that's no 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 bueno. It was like drinking coffee with a pickle in it. Ugh, gross. That is terrible. Yeah, this was pretty jarring. Uh, when when I had my first sip of it, I was like, ugh, no thank you. So that has ruined the plan. So I now just have my steamed milk <laughs> and water. Practically coffee here is what we have. So I guess I need to, after stream, I'll run it a few more times. Very sad. I was actually very much looking forward to some coffee, but that's okay. Uh, Sassy, thanks for being there for date nights last night uh, on a Nyx channel. D&D &D was a lot of fun. Uh, our date nights session uh, is where we play D&D &D on Mr. Sputnik's channel. We're going through Wild Beyond the Witchlight. Uh, very fun. There, there. It was a very good session. Um, a lot of personal, like, character drama. There was a lot of uh, character backstories that were, were, like, being touched on. Um... Some some reveals more more like uh, I don't know just little peeks into different characters' backstories and it's very fun. <laughs> I'm glad you liked it. Uh, it's exciting. It's fun because we were we were talking about this after. So usually after date nights is over, uh, we usually just sit in uh, the Discord call and just kind of talk a little bit and it's always fun. And the constant JPP giggle fits. I don't know what what really tickled me at some point, but I just could not stop laughing. Valk, I wasn't able to watch all of it, but I have to say this the scattering part was hilarious. Where we all split up, that was, <laughs> or not all of us split up, but you know, uh, Mercedes left. I couldn't stop uh, laughing at your nonstop laughing. It, I just. There was, there was just, I was listening to Snezelkin talk, and the way he was talking and just the non-confidence about it, just there's something, the way he said something made me laugh. Uh, and I didn't want to be disruptive because it was kind of a more serious moment, and I just, I couldn't help, so I, I like tried to stifle it down, and then I couldn't, and then he said something else, but then once you get into one of, once I get into one of those moods, um, oh, quickly hiding? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, the, absolutely. Okay, yeah, I see what you're saying, Bob. Um, yeah, that was, for sure, that was really funny. Uh, <laughs> um, but then, yeah, he said something else, and I think once I'm in one of those moods, it's really easy to set me off. And so he, he said something else, I envisioned something, I started laughing again. I just, and then I can't stop. And then there's this, like, part of me that when I start laughing, then I'm like, if I if I chuckle a little bit, then it just sets me off. So I don't know. Wow. It! Thank you for the eleven months. That's awesome. Thank you so much. How's your day going? I've had those moments. I've had them get so bad. <laughs> Yim it! <laughs> uh, how's your day going? Uh. I've had them get so bad that I literally cannot stop and that I can't breathe. Yeah, oh, I've totally been there too. Uh, working again, no! We're gonna be playing more Ghost of Tsushima. We played some yesterday, loved it. It's just so good, it's such a great game. Um, but gosh, so, uh, I'm doing pretty good, I'm doing pretty good. Um, but uh, what was I gonna say? This guy working, unbelievable. <laughs> um, oh gosh, but it was such a good episode. Oh, but we we're, were talking about after after the session last night. We were talking because it's interesting how our character backstories are kind of not related, but um, how they interact with the world in a way. So, like my backstory is mostly tied to the material plane. For those that don't know, uh, in the session or in the uh, campaign that we're in, 
uh, our characters were on our normal plane and then we were uh, taken or we went to uh, whichever way you want to look at it. Um, we went to the Feywild. And so most of this is going to take place in the Feywild. Um, we probably will not be back in the material plane for a bit, for, for quite a while. Um, so we, so my, like my character's backstory is mostly tied to the material plane. Um, there's not a lot of, I, I, I have a motivation to be in the Feywild, obviously, for those who have watched. Um, but, uh, most of what's waiting for me is not here. However, there are a lot of characters, some of the other characters are tied to the Feywild, so it's really neat to kind of see how, like, the backstories are sort of used a bit. Uh, and, uh, y you know, I think Nick was saying, Nick, who's our DM, was like, you know, I'm trying to make sure that, you know, I'm not just, like, spotlighting, like, one or two of you forever, but, you know, we'll eventually get to all that. And I was kind of like, I feel like, you know, you focus on what you need to as a DM. And Vix, welcome in. How are you? Uh, you, you focus on what you need to as a DM because you're, you're kind of weaving a story right now, but, um, at some point we'll eventually get to my, my backstory, I trust, uh, and so we'll, we'll just kind of wait till we get there. Plus, I was like, regardless, I'm kind of viewing the Feywild and viewing what happens through the lens of my backstory, so... There's even if you're not necessarily like actively incorporating it into the plot line, if you will, of like what we're trying to do, my character is looking for still has motivations and things that he he wants. And so, uh, it, you know, I'm I, I'm not I don't feel as though my backstory is being ignored or anything, but he's doing so good. I, I have loved uh, date night so much, so it's just fun. I look forward to every Tuesday night. Uh, I think we decided we're gonna play next week and the week after, but we're gonna take a break mid-August, and then we'll continue the, the following week. Um, both my mom and Mr. Pan will, will talk to me telling me to breathe. <laughs> that just makes it worse. Oh, goodness. Uh, I'm good, Vix. I'm good. I uh, can't wait to learn more about your characters. I know, it's so exciting. And there were some good, I'll leave it spoiler free. There were some good character, not, re well, there was one really good character reveal. Which we had like kind of suspected. And now is a little bit more assured. Uh, and then... Someone else dropped a couple of like knowledge bombs, and so it was just like, wait, what? So it was just very exciting. But then, yeah, and then there was some drama between some of the characters. Uh, I may or may not have shot a bow at one of the other players, or an arrow, not a bow. <laughs> I threw my bow at somebody. <laughs> Uh, no, I, 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 I shot an arrow, maybe, at a character. Sometimes it happens. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes they deserve it, straight up. Anyway. <laughs> uh, and Adrian, welcome in. How is Australia today? Uh, Mercedes talking to Campy almost had me tearing up. Uh, a rainy legit cried, she told us. Uh, it's hard. It, it's hard because she has the uh, the VTuber model up. Um, so, but you could hear it in her voice. But she she cried. Uh, knowledge bombs. Is that another way of saying spoilers? Uh, it, it is a spoiler. Uh, it, but it, I mean, more of like they dropped some knowledge on us. They 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 revealed some things that they knew. So that was very exciting. It's cold and still dark outside. That's fair. Oh, yeah, it's very early for you. It's very early for you. Uh, I have been enjoying, by the way, for those who need an Alaska update, the night is dark once again. Very happy about that. You could totally hear it in her voice. Totally. Totally, totally. 
Uh, do you want to switch seasons with us? I mean, yes. Though, we'll be switching back very soon. Uh, our first snow is usually in October. So, I am excited. <laughs> I, <laughs> I'm excited that we're only a few months away from that. I need it. I need snow on the ground. I need it to be cold. I need to be. I need. I need it to be cold enough where I'm like inside. I need a hoodie. Uh, <laughs> it's just that's my that's my jam. I love. I love cold. I and I now realize that I can pretty much only live in places where <laughs> it's like this, or I would just. I don't know if I'll be at the next two date nights live, and I'm sad about it. No, it's okay, though. It's okay, though. Uh, the VODs exist. <laughs> the VODs exist. But Canada, honeymoon, so that'll be awesome. Sassy. Yeah, don't even worry about us. Just focus on the honeymoon. Well, the VODs will be there. Um, what was I going to say? Uh, gosh, it was just so much fun. Everyone does such a good job playing their characters, too. Uh, Megan, aka Lurkette, is great at, uh, uh, Rowan. And sort of, I don't know, such an interesting character. Uh, and Snezzle is great at being <laughs> this timid, scared trying to be better <laughs> gnome and rainy is great and mercedes and we're very much sticking to i will applaud both rowan and mercedes for uh through even though some of the the drama and some of the conflict is uncomfortable at times because we're like <laughs> trying to make things. Some of us are trying to make things better. Uh, wink, wink, nudge, nudge me. <laughs> so, some people are trying to make things better. Some people are, but but anyway, they both of them play very true to their characters in terms of like, no, they're not happy with with each other, and they're just gonna keep on keep on arguing. I love it. Uh, I know, but there are, uh, so few left that I'll be able to stay up and watch live anyway. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. Enjoy, enjoy Canada. Take your mind off of Twitch for a bit. It'll be totally fine. We'll be here when you get back. Thank you so much for playing my game. I love that part of the song, by the way. Uh... <laughs> Thank you so much for playing my game. Um, <clears throat> I am very excited to play more Ghost of Tsushima. I think it's going to be fun. Can't wait to, to just save the island. <laughs> Yesterday, we actually got to like rescue some people, which felt good. Uh, I don't know why. I, I feel like I keep coming across... Maybe I need to do more sneaky stuff. I don't know. I feel like I keep coming across people in need of rescue, and by the time I get there on my horse, everyone's dead. Like, or all the the good people are dead, and so then I just have to fight the Mongols, and then I am like, I get. I mean, <laughs> what did I do wrong? I don't know. I gotta go switch off with laundry. Nice. Enjoy. How did you do with Ghost of Tsushima last night? I defo crashed out sooner than I hoped. Uh, it was good. We did a bunch of. Uh, Mostly side mission things. I think we did, did we do one main mission? I can't remember. Um, but uh, it was good. Uh, we got a bunch of uh, skill points, so I, I invested those a bit more. I ended up getting smoke bombs, which is like, I love it. Uh, I think that's, I need, I need to upgrade. There's a way to upgrade the amount you can carry through one of the shops, and I need to do that because <laughs> it's just so fun in the middle of like a fight if I need to just smoke bomb <laughs> and then and then end up like assassinating a bunch of people. It's just great. I love it. I guess I should now that I meant I should think about it. I should make sure I put Jet After Dark on this. 
<laughs> la 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 la. Uh, Jet After Dark. <laughs> For those that don't know, Jet uh, Jet After Dark is when we play games that are a little bit more mature than games we would normally play. This falls under that. A little bit violent <laughs> at times. Uh, so what can you do? You know? Uh, but it's so much fun. The visuals, so good. I'm just, I'm here for it. Um. A little? Oh yeah, just only a little violent. I mean, we're only putting them to sleep, so. We're only putting them to sleep, so it's not too bad. Um, what else? Apparently, for the people who play No Man's Sky, apparently the expedition is out now. Uh, we probably won't play that on stream. I'll probably just do that on my own. Um, trying to think if there was any other gaming news I heard. I can't remember. There's Apex stuff, but I know most of you guys don't play Apex, but I am very excited about the things that I'm hearing. Uh, hold on. There you go. Um, is there anything else that's been announced? I feel like there's a bunch of rumors for things. Things that have been leaked. Uh, apparently for uh, people interested in Xenoblade uh, 3, which comes out this Friday, uh, there it, it's getting like crazy reviews. Like 10 out of 10s, 90%, that sort of stuff. Um, so people who are interested in that at all. Uh, I hope you enjoy your game. Uh, I had the Xenoblade game that was on the Wii U, but um, uh, I never finished it. it. The combat was kind of complicated, I thought, and so it was just, it made it more difficult for me to get into, I think. I think I'm more used to like Final Fantasy RPGs, Persona, that sort of stuff, and it's it's like a little bit more complicated. I hope T uh, Talonus will be happy. I know Talonus is a, a huge Xenoblade fan, so. I hope he's picking it up, because he'll be excited. Um, what else? They announced for League, they announced one of the next uh, skin lines, which is called Little Tamers. Emmers, I don't know if you've seen it. I was very excited. They look cool, but I was a little disappointed. They're one, they're almost like Digimon themed or inspired. Uh, it's Viger. Lulu and Kogma. Kogma looks like a a Digimon. I can't remember which one. The dinosaur, the yellow dinosaur. Um, but uh, did I hear my name? Yeah. I did. You see the new skin line that's coming out for League? I think it's called Little Tamers, Tiny Tamers, something like that. It's like they're. Essentially like Pokemon trainers is basically what it is. Ah, uh, no, it looks great. It's, it, it is adorable. And they showed off Vigers and it, he looks cool. He's wearing like, he look, actually now that I think about it, he looks very Sans Undertale. I think he's wearing like a jacket and he has a skull mask on. Uh, and his skills look really cool. Uh, Lulu is wearing like a yellow jacket with uh, like, uh, she and she looks more like a Pokemon trainer or something of that sort. Kogma looks like a Digimon. Um, but I was like, Viger, Lulu, Kogma's not a, a Yordle, but I was like, Teemo? <laughs> Are they giving Teemo another skin? No Teemo skin, Sag. Uh, Gizmo, welcome in. How are you? How's your day? Is it just, is it so bad that I just want more Teemo skins? I don't think so. Gizmo, how was your day? Have you been Morbin? 
By the way, I sent Gizmo a, uh, <laughs> a, a link to a tweet that somebody made a Morbius Minesweeper clone. Morb Sweeper, was that what it was called? I can't remember, but it was incredible. And it's like playable, so we could do that, but we're I'm probably not. Um, such a bad day at work. This whole week is Garbo. No, what happened? Give us deets. I love it. Oh boy. Uh, oh, Morbius. I can't believe they're making a sequel. That's just unreal. I'm getting very excited about Black Panther, by the way. I think that's going to be fun. I can't wait to see Namor. Tank! Welcome in, Tank. How are you? <laughs> Tank, how's it going? Uh, Terrence Edward, hello! Geo, hello! Fresh Fumble, hello! Welcome in, how are you? Uh, let me welcome you in with... A fist bump. Uh, Tank and France, welcome in! How's your day? I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. We're, we're talking right now. We're gonna play some Ghost of Tsushima here in a little bit. But if you would like a fist bump, please go ahead and punch your screen on the count of three. One, two, three. Wa-bam! How are you? Loving the hair beard combo. Thank you so much, Fumble. Do you go by Fresh? Do you go by Fumble? Let me know. Uh, but how you started Ghost of Tsushima today? I know you played it before, but how how was it? How was getting back into the world? Um, what were we just talking about? More more. Uh, oh, I was saying I am very excited for looking at the new Black Panther trailer. I'm very excited. I noticed some things that I think look cool. Uh. Pretty much, I'm pretty. Oh, I'm pretty much you today. We talked a long time, a long, long time, then barely chopped up anybody. Sag. Uh, I go by whatever you want, as long as I know what it is, so I know you're talking to me. Perfect. I'll call you Fumble then. I like that. Um. Uh. That is that is <laughs> that's great. I love that you're chatting though. Zombie Ryan, a double raid, and Geo, have a good day. Thanks for uh, for coming and saying hello. Zombie Ryan, let me let me welcome you all in. Uh, Zombie Ryan, there we are. Uh, back to back smacks. Hello, welcome in. Ginger Ninja Bread, hello. Uh, Gem Exo, hello. Double raid, welcome in. And now we have to welcome you all in with a fist bump. Uh, so, Zombie Ryan, how are you today? I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. Uh, how was your stream? How did it go? Uh, how was Gang Beast? That's so fun. Uh, if you like a fist bump, get and punch your screen on the count of three. One, two, three. Well, bam. Uh, I have not played Gang Beast in a very long time, but how was it? It's a very fun, fun game. Uh, I, I'm trying to think when was the last time I played it. It's very good though. Very fun multiplayer game too. Um, were you playing with people? Doing like a, a, cause wait, is there a solo mode? So it may have been a dumb question. Uh, I too gotta pop off quickly. Uh, got things to do this evening, have fun. Jet, make sushi out of those Mongols. I will, Tank, I hope you have a great day. Uh, and thank you again for the raid. Uh, I'm good man, how are you? We're, we played Gang Beast. It may be the funniest game I've played in a while. It's great. Uh, Fat Earther, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Uh, <laughs> made some sashima. <laughs> I'll stop. Uh, <laughs> um, have you ever played Human Fall Flat? Is that what it's called? It's like Gang Beast in terms of like the physics, I guess, of the game. Uh, and it's co-op if you would like to play it co-op. Uh, but or you could play it just solo. But it's very fun. We're playing that next? Oh, perfect. Okay, yeah. If you like Gang Beast, you'll like Human Fall Flat. It's very good. It's it's also at times very difficult. <laughs> um, but very good. Uh, yeah, well, welcome in, new people. My name is Jet, uh, in the case you don't know. Variety streamer, family-friendly streamer. We play a lot of things here, a lot of indie games, lots of puzzle games, mystery games. We do love solving murders. 
Uh, <laughs> uh, I just thought of yesterday's. We watched an episode of Paranormal Home Inspectors during our just talking time. Uh, and uh, <laughs> Nadine, who is this uh, psychic lady, I guess, uh, She's in, she's trying to see if there's any ghosts in this house, and she's like, "Was there a murder here? Why am I hearing yes?" And she says it with almost no break in between, and I don't know why that just made me laugh. Anyway, uh, we do a lot of stuff here, <laughs> uh, but a lot of indie games, a lot of chill stuff. But today we're playing something different. We're we're doing something we call Jet After Dark, which is when we play a game that's maybe like a bit more mature than uh, what we normally would play. Uh, it kind of gives people the option to watch or not, I guess, if they if they would like. So we're playing Ghost of Tsushima. We've been doing that. Uh, we started last Wednesday, did not play until yesterday. Uh, and so we're, this is part three. And so I'm very excited. I'm loving the game. It's so, so good. I just, I feel like I just want to attack more people. Is that a problem? Maybe. Um, but I love it. Uh, so thank you guys for joining us today. Uh, we'll probably be hopping in there pretty, pretty soon. Um, if you have not played it, boy, do I recommend it. Even having not finished it, even having not gotten very far, uh, it's very good. Uh, I'm playing it on my PS5, so it feels particularly just sharp and crisp. And I don't know, I love it. Gotta skedaddle, but maybe back later. I've uh, been here for a few minutes and I'm digging your stream. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. And thank you for that follow earlier. Um, yeah, we're, we're, we're here most days, uh, except for usually the weekends we've been taking off now. Um, but uh, anyway, thanks for coming in. Um, let's go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and move into the game. Cause I, I again, I've been enjoying it so much that I, I'm sort of antsy a little bit when <laughs> not on stream. There I go, just floating up top here. Um, because I'm like, I just want to play. <laughs> and I'm, I'm trying not to play any of it off stream. Um, so I, the only chance I get to play it is when I'm here with you all. <laughs> and let me just say that I do love playing it. Um... I, I would say the combat has been fun. I'm not great at it. Uh, I occasionally die. So if you're looking for, you know, pro pro player uh, things, maybe not the place, but <laughs> I try my best, and that is important. There, My heart's in the right place. Um off stream photo. The thing is, is I'm afraid. What if I, what if I am taking a few photos and then something happens? You know, I don't, I don't want to do anything that's. By the way, look at the lighting. Look at the sky. It's just, I can't get over it. Look at that. The colors, my friends. The colors. Um. Anyway, there's so much to do, and I don't need to run around, but I do enjoy it. What are th oh, those are fireflies. What do fireflies signify? Oh, do we have some people? Oh, we have a bear. What? Oh, I'm so sorry. Look, I <laughs> I was expecting the bear to kill kill them. Uh <laughs> and I just know I need bear bear pelts. So, apologies. Apologies. It's such a vast open world and if you are like me, you will take too many photos to even reach a mission. But, but like what if I come across somebody? I don't want to level up. You know, back, you know, cuz then part of me is going to be like, well, I should probably No, that's right. I forget you can't hold that forever. I think that's the first one that I've killed. 
Uh, all right. I also, I mean, to be honest, like, I know there are, like, missions that I could be doing, but just running around here. Oh. Oh, a fox den. Hello. I'm going to wait for those guys to, to walk by. Oh, a bot. Get out of here. Uh, where are you? There we go. Get out of here. Wait, where did the fox go? Oh, there you are. Let's follow our foxy friend. We got to pet one of these. Oh, this is quite the roundabout. We got to pet one of these guys. Oh. I could have probably just walked around. I'm going to up the volume just a tad. Unlocked a new charm slot. Good. Uh, also. So you see, like, this one just disappeared. This fox, he's gone. Weird. Okay. Uh, we did just get... Charm of Resistance 1. Well-being. Receive an additional 7.5% of health when healing. While at 50% health or less, healing recovers an additional 15%. Hmm. Oh, only minor charms can be assigned to slots 3 through 6. Wait. Ah, okay, so I can't put any of these. Wait. Wait. What? What? But there are minor charms here. Maybe that's when you have them all unlocked? I'm going to assume that's what it is. It depends on the location of the shrine. I've noticed if it's in a tight spot, the fox isn't there to pet. That's sad. <laughs> that's sad. What kind of nonsense is this? <laughs> The fox, all the foxes deserve to be pet. Prove me wrong. What's that? Have I been there? I have not. Oh, there is also this here. <laughs> Maybe we should do that. This, this game, in a way, like, the setup sort of reminds me of, um... I mean, like, not, like, oh, wait, we have a bird flying over here. We got, uh, kind of reminds me of, like, what is that game called? Uh, were you, you play as Rico Rodriguez, I think is his name. And you're saving Just Cause, the Just Cause series. And that, like, you can run around and you'll just come across enemies at any point. Or, like, I don't know. It's just fun to explore. I wish I could... I feel like I'm not going to be able to get close enough. Oh, they see me. <laughs> All right, let's just do this. I guess they're out in the middle of the field. I can't really do very much. Secret! You always come in right at a time when I just murdered somebody. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> what is up with that? Um, how are you? How's your day going? Oh, gosh. Oh! Oh, gosh, we started already. <laughs> Just 
got this guy. Oh, right. Uh, we just learned how to do that. There we go. Goodbye. Oh, but look! There's somebody to save! You see, this is all for the best. <laughs> Louisa, welcome in. How are you? Uh, Secret, how's your day? How's your day going? You'll be free soon. You see, this was not in vain. This was not just the best day of my life, my lord. You see, we just made that guy's day. If you had this. Uh, and welcome back, Sassy. I have also come to the conclusion that if I had unlimited funds, laundry is the one chore that I would willing to pay someone else to do for me. That is hilarious, and I feel that. I feel like any kind of cleaning dishes. That is always the worst for me. Um, I am enjoying this game, Louisa. It is honestly such a beautiful game, despite the violence that I just caused and wrought upon these people. Um, but, to be fair, they, you know, they, they, they're in our territory. Um, <laughs> nothing special. I'm creating a card so I can send a little Prezi to our new neighbors. Ooh, what are you, what, what are you, are, what are you giving them? That's so nice. Is this the first time you've met them? How are the neighbors? What's the sitch? Oh, the bird's still sending me this way. Oh, it's because of this. Uh, personally, I'd pay someone to mop my floors to dust. Mm. Mopping can also be a thing. That can also be a thing. Let's go to these waters real fast. Um, you're so neighborly. I'm going to the store and getting microwave popcorn and making a card that just says... Oh, that says just pop in by to say hi. Secret. <laughs> Secret. That's so good. <laughs> Secret. That's that's brilliant. Um, <laughs> uh, I like vacuuming, but with one of those cordless ones, I feel like you grab the vacuum earlier when it doesn't have a cord somehow. Yeah, that's true. I actually, I that's actually a good point. I had to buy a heavy duty one. Uh, a while back, so I have like a, a a big vacuum. Which when I bought it, I was like, "So I'm an adult now, I guess." <laughs> when did that happen? Can you be my neighbor's secret? That's so sweet. It is. It is. It is incredibly sweet. Okay, everybody, this is why it's jet after dark. Shield your eyes. There will be bum bum on the screen. Um. <laughs> that way everyone gets a snack and a little card with an introduction. That's so, that's so, that's a great idea. I love that. Let's reflect on my father. I'll never forget the day he was killed. I could have saved my father. If only I was older, stronger. If I wasn't so afraid. Our health increased. I feel like this for Jin is sort of like the equivalent of um, when you're in the shower and you think about a, like a dumb thing you said once in like middle school. I feel <laughs> or he he now reflects on something of his past. Uh, <laughs> he admit that's great. Um, <laughs> Uh, <laughs> come move. I would love to. Oh, that's so nice. I love that. <laughs> it's so true, though. Wait, why is the thing not back? <laughs> why is it? Hello? Capture card? It's fine on here. Why is it? Why have you not popped back in? What? Why are we in the void over here? Hello? There we go. Oh, Pons! Welcome in. How are you? I always think about arguments I could have used. True. I have done that as well. I, I'm i not very good at comebacks. Uh, I think 
usually in the moment, I'm sort of like, what? <laughs> if someone says something to me, I'm just more confused, I think, than, than anything. So I'm just like, what? <laughs> I don't, uh, okay. Uh, and then later I'm like, oh, I should have said something. I should have said a thing. Uh, oh, Ponce, how are you? How are you? What have you been up to? Us, uh, Secret and Sassy, we would make the best neighborhood. Oh, that's so true. Capture cards work for PlayStation and Switch. They do. It's true though. Uh, <laughs> good, just working. How is the work? How is the work going? I'm very excited about season 14. Uh, I always focus on not crying in the arguments. Also true. Uh, <laughs> I get that. Um, I, uh, I'm usually good, uh, in front of people for the most part. But I think I, I think anytime somebody says something snarky to me or I think, I don't know. If they're trying to be offensive, it's usually not until later that I realize that they're trying to be offensive, if that makes sense. In the moment, I'm usually more confused and kind of aloof. Uh, and then it's not until much later that I think about it and I'm like, oh, I think they were trying to be mean. <laughs> I get it now. I <laughs> I see how that works. Uh, the JPP neighborhood we need. Got to win that billion dollar jackpot and could make that happen. Amazing. <laughs> if you win that jackpot, you better win. Just make sure you don't tell people that you won. By the way, I don't know where we are. I figured there'd be like a quest here, maybe. Ooh, linens? Leather, I mean. I take. What's in here? Anybody need anything? Mr. Pan and I keep trying to win. Do it. Wait, why can't I? There we go. Could you imagine? That'd be amazing. All right. Okay. Yeah, I guess I don't know what this is. What is this? Oh, the just the hot springs. That's all it is. Okay. I see. I see, friends. Don't. <laughs> There's literally nothing else here. Okay. I thought maybe someone would have something to talk about. Azamo Prefecture. Where am I going? We need to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to the right spot. We can target it. Both of us built. You know those like. Wait. You know those people who like have built neighborhoods for just their friends or something. That's basically what you need to do. Buy a bunch of land and then just have you all build your own homes on it. Das is das. Oh, Chikurin headband. The warrior's mind is quiet but alive. Like rustling bamboo. Wrong button. Cosmetic? Ooh, look at us. Is it me? <laughs> is it just me? We're me now? Uh, wait, I'm sorry, what? Major increase in health. I didn't realize these give you buffs. What? Major increase to health reduces all damage by a moderate amount. Reduces enemy detection speed by 10%. Moderate increase to melee damage. After, after leaving pompous grass while crouched, enemies will be slower to... Det what? Wait a minute, hold on. What? <laughs> oh no, my capture card, what's happening? Uh, I do it. <laughs> Could make the neighborhood AC theme. Oh goodness. <laughs> That'd be so good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
And then what's this? Track artifacts with the guiding wind. Traveling clears 10% more fog of war on the map. Controller will vibrate within 30 meters of an... What? Why haven't... I didn't know. I didn't know this actually... Does any of the other stuff give you things? No. This is all cosmetic. Then those don't give you things, but these do. Okay. Well. All right. <laughs> well, let's go here for a sec. I didn't know that the controller vibrates when you're near an artifact. I want that. Jet won't leave Alaska, though. Actually, true, though. <laughs> I assumed you guys were moving to Alaska. Is that not... Is that not what I'm getting? <laughs> oh, what's this? You see, like, by the time I get there, all the good guys are going to be dead. Why that while that guy is just Oh I guess I should I should be in my water stance technically. Oh I am in my water stance. Uh normal stance, there we go. Can the neighborhood have a, a Nook's shop that closes at 10? Still going, this guy, though. Oh, do we have a point? Oh, we do have a point, don't we? Uh, he would, wait. <laughs> oh, you could build him an Arctic dome. Just give me like a little dome area that like uh, has just artificial snow that's always falling. That would honestly, I'd be fine with that. Make my house the Zen theme. Yes, please. <laughs> he would never leave his house. I never leave my house now, so that will, not much would, would change. Uh, <laughs> an industrial AC unit. It can have anything we want. It's true. The the options, limitless. Oh, we do, because I was saving up points. That's why. I said, you know what? Let's save up a point. I said to chat. Uh, who's this? Who are these peeps? By the way, I could have used my horse this entire time. I have opted not to. Hello. Hello. Do you know of any supplies in the area? No, my lord. But Kami will lend you aid if you pay your respects. Find the Tori gates, follow them to a shrine, and take what is offered. They say a charm blessed by Kami can change one's fate. I could use that kind of help. Okay. Is this... Hmm. Uh, this game fully goes against my playstyle, though. I'm very much developed a stealth playstyle, and this game really needs you going in all sorts of blazing most of the time. Yeah, I, I sort of picked up on on that a little bit. I love stealth, though. So I, I feel you there. I try to stealth as much as possible. Is this where one of the... No, that's a, like... Ooh, hi. Uh, all right, hold on. So... Wait, hold on. Oh, okay, no, that's fine. We should really upgrade some of our stuff. <laughs> I'm realizing that's a thing we should do. Um, <clears throat> let's 
let's go to that. I wonder if there's a way... I think we're going to be able to sneak in. Unless... We go this way? Uh, I am more of a stealth person as well. So I try to use it as much as possible in here. Entering area of overwhelming forces. Ha 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 ha! But do they know that I'm a ghost of Tsushima? Oh, this is actually a very large area. <laughs> I thought this was... I thought this was going to be much smaller. Hmm, I see. Okay, hold on. <laughs> I still believe in us. Maybe doing some things out of order, but I believe. What's all this? This is very pretty. <laughs> Why am I hearing yes? Exactly. I need that needs to be Ooh. Ah, oh, I thought this was like a new This this seems like it's something. Uh, they're going to tell me to come back here at some point. Very weird that It's too pretty of an area for there not to be more than just I got I replenished my arrows. Yeah, this is a very large area. Um, it's very happy that quote was brought. <laughs> I mean, I had to. It was great because Nick had done it. I had, had said it earlier uh, on. I think it was right before, maybe. And so I was like, it was already on my brain. And then, oh. By the way, I hate heights. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Technically, we didn't really fall. Uh, <laughs> Technically, there there was no falling. We just slid a bit. Okay, let's go this way. Here we go. Like that. I'm. By the way, I'm still determined to get into that area. I know there's no real. <laughs> I know there's no real re <laughs> I didn't know where it wanted me to jump. There you go. Look at me, I'm rolling. Oh, what's that over there? That's something. Well, I guess we're swimming over there now. Also, Nick not understanding why I was sad about him veining the letter K. Yeah, I, I saw that. Oh, I'm underwater? Wait, hold on. Okay. Whew. Didn't even know there was an oxygen bar in this game. Um, that was funny. That whole exchange was very funny. Uh, for those that don't know, Nick Nick banned Lykel, who's is often in this chat. Uh, Nick banned Lykel for. <laughs> it wasn't even during one of Nick's streams. Is during one of Rainy's streams. Nick was uh, playing Apex with Rainy. And Lykel was in Rainey's chat saying Nick with a K. He, he, he is Nick with a C. Just a C. Um, and he was like, look, Lykel, I can't, I have no power here, but that doesn't mean I can't ban you in my chat. So Nick just banned him in his chat for fun as a joke and then uh, forgot to unban him. <laughs> and so... Uh, Ooh. Lost and found. Twilight Oni. A night falls. Death approaches. Is this, uh... Oh. Interesting. I don't know if I... I mean, like, it's neat. <laughs> it's neat. It isn't... These are just cosmetic things. The butterflies are kind of cool. Or dragonflies, I mean. 
But honestly, I like both. These two, we haven't done this one in a bit. Let's try this. Uh, we, we've been using this one. Let's try this one. I like the waves and stuff. That patterns. But I do like collecting things. Uh, <laughs> I try to stick uh, to stealth where possible, too. I'm actually quite scared of playing games and just going for it, which I realize is very stupid because the worst that can happen is you die and respawn. But legit, I've noticed I'm very feel fearful of that in games. That's fair. I think that's fair. Uh, I get that way sometimes, too. Uh... But I don't know. I feel like sometimes I just get dying out of the way, so that way I'm like, cool. All right, I know what it's like. I don't have to worry about it anymore. <laughs> and now there is Nick. I got Nick command with Lykel's apology. Like, so Lykel sent in an unban request because Nick forgot to unban him. Uh, and <laughs> the unban request was amazing. It was hilarious. And now there's a copy pasta. Anytime someone says Nick with a K, it's just it's so good. I love it. Okay, let's see if we can sneak in from this this side. I'm scared of heights IRL, so if I fall off a cliff in a game or something, my stomach does flip. I hate it. Oh, that's fair. I am. I hate heights. Uh. Oh, they see me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I guess I'm not supposed to be here. <laughs> they just. Oh, hold on. Maybe I should just dodge more. Oh, is this where her brother is held? No, this is not it. I'm just gonna keep... How many... Wait. <laughs> I... Oh my... How many archers are there? Okay. <laughs> I guess we have to be here for a quest or something. <laughs> Seems like they don't want us here. Rude. <laughs> Such fun times to be had, true. Date nights is so fun. Okay, let's just go do the quest then. I didn't see any places for us to sneak in. Oh, I can also change. So if I'm wearing this, it I wonder how it vibrates when something's near. Like, what kind of vibration? What is that? Here's a place. Let's fight somebody. Are you cowards? El day Ashiglach, samurai. I feel like as we died a little bit, we need to at least, you know. Fight a couple of things. Somebody up top? That's rude. There you go.
we need more we, we can get unlock a new stance if we kill more leaders. The wind stance. Oh, hello. I missed! <laughs> Think he knows I'm here? Yep. <laughs> they, they know I'm here. Who was that? <laughs> oh, it's this guy. Okay. Duck and roll, duck and roll. I like that there's a more realistic load time for them. Like, uh, oh, wait. there's an artifact nearby. Um, like, it, like when they're reloading a, an arrow, it takes them a while to, to, I don't know, it's just, it's nice. Ooh. That does not seem like that's an artifact. Hold on. I can't tell if it gets stronger when you're closer to it. Or if it just is like there's something in the area that you should know about. Oh, maybe it is. Oh, maybe it's in here. Yeah, they can't spare. Yeah, and it gives you a moment if they like fire. There's nothing here. Uh, if they fire, then you know, like, okay, that's when I need to attack now. Okay, is it? Oh, is it this? Mongol artifacts. There we go. I didn't know what it looked like. I thought it was going to be in a chest or something. Um... Let's see, but with regards to heights, uh, though there's this thing when I go to Disney World that I'm absolutely terrified to do, they have like a sky tram transport system that is a glass cable car type thing that goes up into the sky. Yeah, it sounds scary, but I know I'm gonna have to go on it to get in between some of the parks and places we're going to. I guess I'll try it despite not wanting to, but you are the first person I know I've told this to that can relate to the height thing, so I figured you're a good person to all. That's fair, no, 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 that's good. Uh, I'm sure it'll be fine. I feel like Disney does, you know, obviously they, they put a lot of, you know, time and safety into things. So I'm sure that once you're there, it'll, it'll feel, it'll feel a little better. Probably you'll feel more contained than you're imagining. Uh, okay, wait. Uh, okay. We are still selected there. Nobu. Oh, by the way, I posted in the Discord um, <laughs> a uh, embroidery that I saw that I was like, I need this. <laughs> it's very Reese, but it's also kind of me, too. I should go to a town. I hopefully there where we're meeting our buddy. Maybe there's like some merchants. It'd be pretty easy to replicate. <laughs> it didn't look super complicated, but I was like, I love that. Crime brulee. That was a that was a that was a Taka's counting on us. 
I love the kid, but this is too dangerous. It will never work. We'll make it work. <clears throat> this the samurai? You can call me Lord Sakai. Huh. Forgive me, my lord. I am Kenji, upstanding merchant, renowned sake brewer, and the best swindler on the island. That's why he's going to help us rescue my brother from Azamo Bay. That town's a fortress. If the Mongols took it, they'll need an army to penetrate the walls. Or a single delivery of sake. <laughs> It'll never work. Get your sake ready. We'll discuss the plan on the move. <laughs> Let's have a drink first. Talk this through. Now, Kenji. <laughs> I bet this is the place that we were going where I just instantly got obliterated. <laughs> it makes sense now. When we get close to the top, <laughs> oh, <laughs> the same I needed that. I always sell them. They love my dars. Dars, I... Mughal, give a dars now. You've been doing business with the enemy. I keep the Mongols drunk. And they let me keep my head. Uh, oh, sir. I feel sure like I needed that for this game. This. Anything for Taka. How bad is the occupation in Azlomo Bay? A few people fought back. The ones left alive are prisoners or slaves. But you Hold on. I need to switch my gear. Uh... Uh, I'm down to the last four areas to 100% in the Psychonauts 2. Oh, that's awesome. Dang. Positive pick in the Pets channel. My current situation? Aw. Also, I loved the picture. I, I meant to reply, and I totally forgot. The pictures of uh, your cat yesterday also were so good. Oh, but they look so cozy. They look so cozy. Uh, certainly it will be safe, and I've watched some vlogs on YouTube about it that suggest people who are also not good with heights haven't found it too bad considering. So, oh, okay, that's good. Uh, <laughs> uh, let me do this no. for this fight. But someone's been working the forge the past few days. Maybe it's your brother. How long have you two known each other? Since I was too young to know better. I was <laughs> just starting to brew sake. Sold you know my first batch. <laughs> Tasted like piss, but it was cheap. For a while, I tried to get Taka's help selling it. Turned out he was too soft. People told him sob stories, and he'd give them sake, free of charge. Ah, uh, we have people up ahead. <clears throat> Mongols. Damn, you two better get in the car. There aren't many. I can handle them. No, Jin. Taka is so close. Please. All right. So we're trying to rescue her brother, who is a, a blacksmith. Get ready. They might search the car. You said they don't do that. The town <laughs> gates. I've never seen them this far out here. Please, can she be a boy? Two, go. Dark. Dance for Azamo Bay. Aha! Dance! Hurry up! Uh oh. Just a little farther. What was all that screaming? Doesn't matter. Keep it down. Is that what Taka's <laughs> going through? Your brother's a skilled blacksmith. They won't treat him like that. You don't know that. We're getting close to quiet. This seems like, I don't know, a terrible plan, but. I can't believe this worked. <laughs> oh no. Somebody must have pissed off the Mongols. They burned half the town. Yeah. 
This is where we part ways. Keep the Mongols drunk and distracted. I'll do my best. Stay safe, Kenji. And you, Lord Sakai. Taka's waiting for us. Let's go. Once we're done, I'll meet you at the crossroads behind town. We need a vantage point to scout ahead. This way. Remember, no alarms. We do this quietly. All the prisoners suffer. Got it. Okay, so this is a full stealth mission. Look thirsty. I'm getting I'm here. Look, by the gate. He's in charge. A slaver. Bastard. He's inspecting the prisoners like they're horses. He might lead us to Taka. Follow him. Uh, <clears throat> did I ask if you got the Mirage anime skin? I have not yet. Uh, just because I haven't had the extra money to spend on uh, coins. But I probably will at some point. I, I hope to get it before uh, it, the, the thing runs out. I was able to get the banner uh, pose. Um... Uh, using crafting metals. Uh, but yeah, I was like, I need to get this skin. I just need it. It's so nice. <laughs> it's so good. I'm very excited about the new legend, though. The legend seems really interesting. I'm curious how... I don't know, how, how she'll play with like her abilities and stuff. It'll be fun. I think tomorrow's... Uh, one of the, uh... Oh. I think tomorrow's, uh, video. Moose's tooth skin, let's go! Oh my goodness. Wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> Tomorrow trailer, yeah, I'm so excited. Taka's probably fine. He wouldn't try to run. Let's go. I'm very tempted to assassinate. <laughs> but I know that's not what we're supposed to do. To be a ninja, I would just love it. I hope we get to come back here. The lighting in this game. So good. What is problem? Your blacksmith. Wait, he, is he in dying light? Oh, Pons? I don't think I knew that. I know it. Taka's here. He is only blacksmith. Oh, I'm a blacksmith too. And I'll do much better work. I cannot be too. I get rid of him. But be ready to prove yourself. That bastard. He'll kill Taka. He's in everything. True, though. Uh, I saw... So they, they put out, like, a, um, a little Twitter clip of... Uh, I think it was. Mark is full of Mongols. It was like a phone call, sort of. Stay close, you know. It was like a call, and somebody on the one of the voices on the line. I can't remember if it was Mara calling somebody or if it was. I can't remember who it was, but um, one of the voices. It sounded like Roger, and I'm pretty sure it was, but I couldn't tell if that was. 
I actually could not tell if it was Mirage pretending to be somebody else or if it was like if he was trying to fake a phone call or like not fake a phone call, but like pretending to be somebody he's not to try to get information or if they had just reused Roger for something. Uh, <laughs> and it, I, it, that kind of made me chuckle, but the way through. He's great. <laughs> Wait a minute. How do we? Oh no! Wow. How am I supposed to get over there? Okay, it starts me here. Can I assassinate this guy? Actually, ninjas. <laughs> uh, how can I get up higher? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> We're so good at this game. <laughs> Just so good. Slaver. Can't let him get away. Don't mind me. <laughs> no, please. I need to rest. It's Taka. Please! You know, Taka? What did they do to you? You're safe now. I need to move. You can't. They'll catch us, just like the others. This is Lord Sakai. He'll protect us. I need Sleep. you to trust me, Toka. <laughs> I need your help. I'll try, my lord. We just need to hoist you over this giant wall. How are we getting him out of here? nearby then that's where we break out what are the chances that they find the body like very fast they found the slaver they'll kill us we need to hide <laughs> keep moving we can climb those crates i feel like i should help taka <laughs> get over the gate but... He's Where fine. are we going? Kenji's waiting for us at a crossroads. Kenji's with you? If he made it out alive. I love that everyone else hid with me when I went to go hide. That's great.
which way? Okay, we go this way. I don't see many places to hide. There's some over there. Horses, they're coming for us. Get in the tall grass and stay down. It's Kenji, Taka, you made it. Were you followed? No. But we can't go back to my place. It's crawling with Mongols. We should go. We have to put some distance between us and Azamo Bay. Why is he shouting? <laughs> also, he needs to chill out for a bit. Haven't seen a Mongol since dawn. I think we're clear. We need to figure out where to go next. There's a place up ahead where you can see most of Izahara. Everyone all right? I could use a drink and some sleep. I can help with one of those. <laughs> Taka, you've been quiet. First time in days, I haven't felt like I was about to die. My lord. That seems like an I'm ominous grateful. statement. Don't say but that. How do you know Kenji and my sister? I owe you know my life. <laughs> we have something in common. Archers rise. I'm not built for riding all night. <laughs> Komatsu is just over that ridge. They have a forge. One of the best on the island. Good place to make tools. Maybe something to get gin over the walls of Castle Canada. What do you say, Taka? My lord, I'll do anything to repay you for freeing me. Thank you. Taka, Kenji, get some rest. We can't stay here long. How are you doing? I have my brother back. He's shaken up. Can you get him to Komatsu in one piece? With food and rest, he'll be fine. Your brother wasn't the only prisoner in Azomo Bay. You're going to save them. And make their captors suffer. Good. Right for Komatsu Forge. I'll join you when I can. Jin. Thank you. Also, can your brother make me a sword, like, right now? <laughs> I know he just got back, but... Complete! We helped her out. Nice. Oh, we have three points. I'll take it. Hey, let's take a look at this real fast. Uh, what were we going to do? Did I say we were going to add another smoke bomb? That only... No, 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 no. I think I was going to go for this. Yeah, yeah, I'm going for chain assassination. If I move quickly with precision. Because there's actually moments once. where you can edge. get up to at least three people. So I feel like there's use there. Um... What else? What should we do? We don't have any of this stuff. Very curious what these three things are. Uh, let's do the spear parry. We got to learn to parry more. Also, look at this view. I love it. I would live up here. This, I'd make my home that. Wait, where's this bird going? Can I even follow you down there? <laughs> I don't... I don't think so. Uh, hold on. This is the forge, right? Hmm, should I go? 
Okay, here's what we'll do. Let's go up to the forge. I'm curious if... Um... I'm curious if we can get something good there. Plus, we can probably upgrade our, our gear. And then... Um, so it's there. And then we can go back down and rescue everyone. Look at us go. All right. Also, what is this? Oh, is it a fox den? Love it. Hello. So calm, so peaceful. Okay, hopefully we get to pet the fox here. There's like a, a lot of space. Look at that precious boy. Oh, hello. I want one so bad. I wish you could have, like, a fox companion. I'd be all for that. Okay, now let's go up here. Uh-oh. I don't know what animal that was. <laughs> Oh. oh my god, what just happened? I should go for this archer, because, uh... Perfect parry. Not a not anything. <laughs> okay, it's just rude. I just love this. Alright, uh, where are we going? I don't know if this is technically like the right way. Kind of going up the hill. Let's go around this mountain.
Fallen outpost. Uh-oh. Let me just keep writing. Keep trying to parry, and then they keep using moves that you cannot parry against. And so we get awkward moves like that. Someone to save. I did not kill these people just in pure vain and vanity. I always remember you. Go. Be well. Please. A token of my gratitude. Okay. Uh, oops. Was a bird. Where are you taking me, bird? Bamboo strike. I don't see it. Or is it this? No. Oh, there it is. Ugh. All right. X, L1 square. X, L1 square, L1, X. X, L1 square, L1, X, circle, circle. X, L1 square, L1, X, circle, circle. Nope. <laughs> X, L1 square. Do, 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 do. Uh... Nope. That's the three. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Boop, boop. I forgot. There we go. Okay. All right. So we're... Okay, here. 
Mongol territory? Really? Yuna, is that you? Jin. Oh, look at that armor. You made it. What happened here? Where's Taka? Hiding with what's left of Komatsu. Mongols came a few days ago. They took prisoners, killed anyone who put up a fight. Now they're coming back to finish the job. These were just scouts. Oh, I'm not. I did not I know that, Luisa. Thank you. Behind. Then we have to go. Now. We can hold this town. What? We need Komatsu's forge and its people. Thank you for letting me know. If you need to, you can leave. No. I'm tired of running. Take me to the others. Ooh, we have to save Taka again. You're very welcome. Thank you so much. Yeah, I completely, when we switched over, we are like mid-chat, and I completely left. forgot. Families. Mostly farmers and blacksmiths. Not worth much in a fight. Um. You killed all these men by yourself? Good work. I've had some practice. Can you get more arrows? Used ones. Stuck in buildings. And bodies. They'll have to do. I was out here leading villagers to safety. One of them got trapped over here by the Mongols. She's alive. I is it safe? The Mongols are gone for now. I'll go into the forge. You'll be safer with us. Is the forge working? Yes, but we can't light it. The smoke will give us away. Show the Mongols where to find us. We can use it to lure them in. Force a fight at a location we control. They won't be expecting you here. Lord Zakai, Yuna. Taka. Hello. I'm here. Wait, what's this? I prayed the gods would protect you. I appreciate it. But I came for your help. Yuna said you needed something. A new tool. To save Lord Shimura. He's held prisoner in Castle Canada, and I need to break him out. Quietly. With no one seeing. This town has a forge. And you're a blacksmith. The best. I might be able to make something. But there is no time. The Mongols. I won't let them take Komatsu. We're staying. I need my assistant, Yukio. But we got separated. Where is he? I think he was looking for his wife. In town. I'll find Yukio. Yuna, be ready to fight. She always is. 
Uh, I wonder what tool we're gonna get. I hope it's awesome. Enemies nearby. I guess I could have done my listening thing. I forget that's actually an option for me. Hello. Wait, more enemies nearby? Aha. I like this idea that <laughs> he, like, went upstairs to rescue them, and they're like, mm, you can't. There's... There's an enemy nearby. He goes, assassinates that person, runs upstairs, you're like, mm, nope, not yet. More people. Stop. Jumps out window. You killed? Don't. Yes. Taka needs help with the forge. Follow me. Oh, wait. My wife and her sister are by the river. Lead me to them. Quickly. This way. Stay close and follow my orders. Goodbye. Uh, don't look at it. Look at me. Yes, my lord. The Mongols found them. Stay here. Then <laughs> Oh, no. Nope, not you. sent me. He's alive. Follow me. Taka needs your husband. Mutsu. My love. Yukio. My god, I lost you. Are you hurt? That man fought like an animal or a demon. I'm no Only demon. Only when I'm facing Mongols. We're going to the forge. I'm Stay a close. ghost. Of Tsushima. Send your best warrior. What are you doing? Beep it, 
Is everyone else okay? Everyone alive? Spin for dominance. Uh, oh. Okay, let's keep going, friends. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what do you think you're doing? I honestly don't remember. What? Oh gosh. I think everyone is alive still. Is everyone alive? Yeah, okay, gosh, there's four of them. There should be anyways. That was close. I don't know if it would restart the mission if one of them... Probably. I got your friends. Yukio! He saved us, Taka! Thank you, my lord. The Mongols are here. Where's Yuna? She went to get a family from the house across the river. Hasn't come back. Damn. Don't light the fortune until we come back. Okay, now... Now where's Yuna? Uh. Okay. I'd love another smoke bomb. Uh oh. Jim, oh. over here. She's fine. We're ready to light the forge. Taka said you're looking for a family. I was too late. The Mongols captured them just across the river. Those people took my brother in when he was an apprentice. Then we won't leave him behind. Let's go. Get up on the roof from here. Oop. 
two people inside. Where's the other person? There they are. Uh. Oh no! I thought it would assassinate him! Smoke bomb. You, you saved us. This fight's not over. Can you make it to the forge? Yes, I think so. Everyone, stay close to me. Okay, so now we have to escort them back to the the forge. Where did he come from? It's a long story. The way he killed them. Uh -oh. He's not human. Maybe you're right. Are they technically <clears throat> hidden when, when it's like this? How does this work? I liked how in The Last of Us, the first game, at the very least, one of the things that I liked was that if you were hidden, even if the like your NPC companion was running around like trying to get into position it still counted it as if Yuna, they were in like hidden. thank the gods i liked that i don't know if this game is like like that. the forge took what about the mongols they won't risk destroying this place that gives us a chance to kill them all if they don't kill us first either way this is where we make our stand Uh-oh. Oh my gosh, wait, I... We have to stop them. Against me? I'm so sorry, dog. Wait. 
Really should invest in that slow down time. Yeah, they're using dogs. Oh, come on. Oh, that's me. I totally got confused. So sorry, doggo. Oh, hello. I need a cool headband like his. I've never seen a samurai fight like that. It was nothing. You are more than a samurai. He is a vengeful spirit. Back from the grave to slaughter the Mongols. Say it. Where do we hide oh. now? You don't. 
Fire up your forge. And get back to making strong Komatsu weapons. That's how we fight back. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. Vengeful spirit? Say it. I think they liked it. Thought she was gonna say the ghost of Tsushima. So do I get a cool weapon from this? Or something? Maximum resolve increased. And HP. Choose a new ghost weapon. Hmm. The black powder bomb is an explosive that damages and stagger, staggers, staggers nearby enemies. Sticky bomb. Throw a pitch-covered bomb that will stick to your enemy before exploding. I honestly think the wind chime could be super useful. Guards will investigate odd sounds. These chimes can be a distraction or a lure. Might be kind of a waste initially. <laughs> I just feel like... I could lure people in and then, like, assassinate. That's kind of what I'm, what I'm thinking. Uh, I really need to upgrade stuff. Ooh, cutscene. I read that samurai follow a path of honor. It is one of the many differences between us. Mm. Then why have my men found their brothers stabbed in the back? Lord Sakai would never resort to such tactics. Uh-oh. War brings out who we truly are. It has made you a dog. Unleashed by your cousin Kublai to rape and pillage at his command. Your nephew strays from the warrior's path. He will become what you hate. Unless you join my empire's fight for peace. You don't want allies. You want soldiers to overthrow the Shogun. Consider my offer. Help your nephew regain his honor before his cowardice goes too far. And before I bring you his head. No. I can't uh -oh. free my uncle until Tucker finishes what he's working on. Ranged weapon swapping. Hold L2... And then uh, directional to switch between your ranged weapons. Is this? What is this? Got some more singing crickets. Hello, who are you? I saw a flock of birds circling in the sky, my lord. I went to see where they were and found the most beautiful place. I sat and stared, lost track of time. We all need inspiration these days. During times of conflict, warriors would visit such places and write haiku. I heard the art of haiku prepares the mind and body for battle. Is it true, my lord? It is. But you don't have to be a warrior to benefit from poetry. They're reading towns everywhere. Komoda was only the first. Okay. There was a bird around here. Still working on your timing tool, my lord. Give me more time. Okay.
You like the finish. Apologies. You don't have what we need to do the work. Goodbye. So we still have to wait for... No one can stop me. How do I get there? We still have to wait for... An honor to serve you, my lord. Linen supplies linen. Okay. Let's go here. So we can level up our stuff. At least if I work metals, woods, and cloth. Yes. An excellent choice. Okay, so I need... That's actually not too bad. I need 20 Predator Hide to upgrade... I'm sorry. I need more for that. You need a lot more, I see. Okay. I look forward to hearing of your Do you Merchant. need anything, my lord? New armor dies. Oh, that's dope. Uh Okay, we did not unlock more bow vanity gear. Doesn't seem worth it. I just I don't know. It seems like a limited resource. I don't want to spend it on Go with Kami's protection. Lord Sakai. I don't want to spend it on stuff if there's something cooler later. I'm happy to um, offer my services. Okay, I think this is where we're going to stop for today. But thank you guys for hanging out. We are going to raid uh, Mr. Sputnik, uh, who's on. And I'm excited he's online. Um, but Yimit, thank you so much for resubscribing. Tank for the raid. Zombie Ryan for the raid. Fat Earther for the follow. Uh, I appreciate it. Uh, let's go over and go say hello to him. He's playing Multiversus, which... Uh, is uh, a new a new fighting game that looks pretty exciting, and it's I think it's free question mark or maybe the beta is I don't really know. Uh, ending so soon? Yeah, I figured it was a little bit more of a, a more or a more quiet day. Figure we'll we'll save this for tomorrow. We'll we'll kind of continue from there. Uh, but plus Nick is streaming, and I want to I want to go support him as well. So let's go say hello to Nick. If you haven't already, uh, Nick is my DM for date nights, uh, and uh, he's just wonderful. Uh, he's he's wonderful. Uh, so I'll see you guys later. Uh, I will see you tomorrow with more Ghost of Tsushima. We'll also watch an episode of um, Paranormal Home Inspectors. So I'll see you guys then. I'll see you next time. Bye bye. <laughs>